Then action. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Bryn. Today we are looking at when to use the GoPro Hero Spot Meter function. You should turn on Spot Meter when filming from within a dark space, pointing the camera into a brighter setting, such as filming the road ahead from inside a car or from inside a house pointing out the window. Let's look at some comparison footage. With the spot meter turned off, the inside of the vehicle is quite bright, but the outside is way too bright. With the spot meter turned on, the inside of the vehicle looks darker, but the outside looks a lot nicer. You just have to decide what your main focus is for the footage. All the Hero cameras have a slightly different way of turning on spot meter. In the Hero 1, go to the settings menu and continue on until it says CNT, which is the abbreviation for Centre Weighted Average Meter. Press shutter and change to spot. In the Hero 1, to go back to the main camera menu, continue on through until you reach escape and press the shutter select button. When spot meter is on, the spot meter symbol appears in the front LCD screen. Here's how to turn it on in the GoPro Hero 2. Go to settings and continue through until you see the spot meter symbol. It's a rectangle with a dot in the middle. Turn spot meter on. In the Hero 2, the quick way to go back to the main camera menu is to press and hold the shutter button. Again, the spot meter symbol is shown on the front LCD screen. In the Hero 3, go to the Settings sub-menu and continue on to Capture Settings. A few different Hero 3 functions have been grouped together here. Go to Spot Meter and turn on. Again, press and hold the shutter button to go back to the camera mode menu. The spot meter symbol also appears on the Hero 3 front LCD screen. Using the spot meter function may help to make the outside footage look even better. This is Bryn, thanks for watching.